So Halloween is here. Well, kind of. A little bit. I'm finding Halloween in stores. More specifically, Michael's. I mean, honestly, I didn't really try anywhere else, but Michael's has it. And it's mid-July. As of recording this right now, courtesy of Larry, I know that it is 108 days until Halloween. But we're finding it already. And so I'm gonna show you what I found so far and what I managed to get. I did get a couple things, not to the extreme yet, because I feel like as far as decorating this year, I kind of want to put mostly everything out to figure out how much room I have left. I mean, really, it's not like I can be overcrowded with Halloween. That's not a problem. But things that may need to go on a table, I want to make sure I have enough room for that. So I may not buy a whole bunch just yet, but I'm definitely going to be looking. So for now, we're focusing on Michael's. So this is what I saw. I love these. So this stuff, you know that texture stuff that's kind of like crinkly, kind of like paper crinkly, but not really paper crinkly. It's that kind of stuff. So there's wreaths, and there's that says boo, there's black cats, and then it goes into more signs kind of like that. And now we're going into the pillows, and I feel like I have way too many pillows. I had to resist trying to purchase any of these because I'm actually trying to get rid of some. I feel like I'm keeping all Halloween pillows, some Christmas, and just getting rid of the rest. Like that's basically what my room has come to. So I had to resist, at least for now, until I clear some out. So I love the bats one. I'm kind of leaning towards the bats because I do have a few ghost pillows already and plushies. And the one I didn't show that one down way at the bottom that just looked black, it was that. 
and I kind of love these guys. I might get something like that. But like the ghost pillow, I actually have a giant ghost pillow that I have yet to put back on my bed. I actually just saw it in my closet recently. I was trying to clear some space out of my closet, honestly, for more Halloween stuff. That's a whole other subject, all on its own. So there are these, these are super cute. And this, this was a full wall of pastel colors. It's not really my thing, but it is for some people. So I showed it anyway. And I mean, they're cute. It has skeletons and skulls, and I kind of liked that skull piece there, but again, not really for me. I'm more into like black, orange, you know, the usual Halloween colors. But they're cute. If you like that, they're cute. And this was the whole back wall. That spider web thing I kind of like with that spider in it. That ghost is kind of cute. Stay weird. I like that. So there are some things I like. I just wouldn't buy for myself and keep it in my room. Just because it wouldn't go with anything. There would be all this dark black and orange and then this one bright pink thing or... Those are okay. But... It just, it wouldn't mix. Like if I got a skull like that, no. Or a pumpkin like that, jack-o'-lantern like that, no. So that pink ghost, I don't want to say it just yet in case she's watching, but I did something about that pink ghost. I'll tell the story later. There are cute decorations. I kind of like those see-through ghosts. Those are kind of cute. I feel like most of it is this right now. I honestly don't remember what those said. I tried to zoom in a little bit. I tried to get close to be able to read them, but I honestly don't remember what they said. And that disco thing is a big no for me. Again, might be someone else's favorite, so I showed it. So that's what I saw. I did get a couple things, like literally a small couple things that I just couldn't resist. So I don't remember if it was last year or the year before where I started like this little Halloween village. I always kind of did like a Christmas village just because it kind of went with my family growing up. There was one aunt I had that had this giant Christmas village. Anyway, I decided to start a Halloween village. And so the spooky town, I always love the spooky town stuff. And so even though they are still in their plastic here, I got the jack-o'-lanterns. So I'm gonna kind of spread those around. I have little bits and pieces. I don't have any like big houses or anything like that yet, but I figured these I can kind of spread around to what I have right now. And then there was a little section with little miniature things, not necessarily like Spooky Town, but just kind of off to the side. I didn't film any of that. I figured I'd leave some to the imagination or maybe go back and film the other area. It wasn't really in Halloween, which is why I didn't do it. It was more dark stuff, kind of like the gothic decor that they came out with earlier this year. It was kind of like that. But there was one thing that I saw that I really liked. Actually, there were a couple things, but one I got. And it's like a little table with, here, let me get out of the way. Table with like a book and like a witch's broom, witch's hat. And I don't know, I'm waiting for it to focus. Maybe I'm in the way, but yeah, I was in the way. So there's little, books and a little skull on top and then there's the witch's hat 
and like a little potion bottle. I just thought this was really cute. And then there's the witch's broom there. So these are the only two things that I got so far. And believe me, there will be more. There will be so, so much more. And this is just one store. I haven't gotten to TJ Maxx home goods yet. That I already know what I want to get, but I'll save that for that video. So Halloween's out. If you haven't discovered it for yourself already, it is so much fun to see in the stores. In July. It's July. It's 108 days away and we're seeing Halloween. This is going to be a fun season. I'll try to get to another store soon, but this is what I've seen at Michael's so far. So if you guys have bought anything from Michael's, let me know. Let me know what you got. Let me know what you're excited to see because I am so excited to see more from them. Little bits of Halloween is coming out. It's our time. All right. I'll see you guys later. Bye.